How to accurately shorten bolts. In this video, I will demonstrate how to shorten multiple bolts at the same time. On a mill, you can get them accurate within a couple of thou, and on a surface grinder, you can get them accurate within a couple of tenths. Okay, so we want to shorten this bolt up. Normally what we do is just go to the bandsaw, cut it off, take it to the grinder, and then shorten up the, the other amount. Well, in this particular case, we needed an exact size from nip to tip here. There's two ways we can do this to get it an exact size. There's a way of double nutting here, but I'm going to make a block. So this block here allows me to let my head here sink in by about five thou. So therefore, when I set this down, I'm going to machine this off. And what I machine this off to will be the height of my screw. So in this case, it's gonna be three quarters of an inch. Then I'll turn around and I'll grind the 45 back onto the end of the threads. If I really needed a super flat and super accurate, I would actually bring this into the grinder and grind these down. Okay, so I touched off with a piece of paper. I'm not physically touching the workpiece. So about three thou up. Turn this guy on. And away we go. Let's take this out and double check. We'll do the center one. They're all the same. Pull this out. Make sure that we don't have any burrs protruding off the top and it looks like we're good. Turn around here. So we're basically one and a half thou larger than what we need to be, but we're well within tolerance. So this is how uh, you shorten out bolts to precise sizes. Then we'll turn around and we'll hit this on the grinder and grind a 45 back onto this guy. Told you this was gonna be a fast video. At the beginning of this video, I talked about, oh, there's a way of double nutting. Well, you can double nut using jam nuts and then put it inside of the lathe and then face the end of the bolt to the exact size that you want. That's a one-off, but this way you can do multiple at the same time. Back in the day, one of the places where I worked at, the owner, before he hired you, would come down and say, here, let, I want you to machine something for me. And he'd give you a washer or a bolt and say, I want you to shorten this or make change the thickness of this or drill out a different diameter. Because these things are difficult to hold, depending on the equipment that you have, he would see how you'd think out of the box and find out how much time it took you to do new things you weren't used to doing. If you have any stories like this that you'd like to share, put them in the comment section. Or if you have any comments, put them in the comment section as well. Thanks again for watching and have a great night.